we are going to learn how to add mixed fractions with like denominators. So our objectives here are to show you the steps that you follow and then walk through about three or four examples together using those same steps. So here are the steps that we're going to walk through. The first step we're going to do is add the whole numbers together. Then we're going to add the numerators together. We're going to create a new fraction. And you have to remember that we do not add the denominator if, actually, we do not add the denominator under any circumstances. In this case, we have like denominators. So we're just going to use the denominator that we have. And once we're done with this new fraction, we will simplify it and uh, reduce it to its lowest terms. Now let's walk through some examples together. So what is the value of 2, 1, 7th plus 3, 3, seventh. So our first step is to add the mixed numbers together. So 2 plus 3, that's going to give us 5. Then the next thing we're going to do is add the numerators of the fraction. We have the same denominator, 1 plus 3. So this is going to give us 5, 4 over 7. And that's our answer here. Second example, we have 3, 2 over 15 plus 4, 8 over 15. The first thing we're going to do is add 3 and 4 together. That's going to give us 7. Now we have the same denominator of 15. We have 2 plus 8. This is going to give us 7, 10 over 15. And now we're going to simplify the fraction if necessary or if it's possible. We can see here that this has a common factor of 5, common factor of 5, so this is going to give us 7, 10 divided by 5 is 2, 15 divided by 5 is 3. Next example, we have 6, 4 over 21 plus 1, 11 over 21, so we have 6 plus 1, that gives us 7, now we have 4 plus 11 over 21, this is 7, 15, over 21. Now we divide because there's a common factor of 3. So this is going to give us 7. 15 divided by 3 is 5. 21 divided by 3 is 7. So that's our final answer. And finally, we have 2, 1 over 16 plus 2, 9 over 16. First thing is 2 plus 2. That's going to give us 4. Then we have 1 plus 9 over 16, which is 4, 10 over 16. And then we simplify the fraction here. Divide by 2, divide by 2. This is going to give us 4, 5 over 8. And that's our final answer.